Mind the drop. Yes. Oh. He's dead. No choice. Sorry. Yes. Sorry. Come, we'll cross. Good. Now we do things safe and slow. No taking stupid risks. Hugo, if you feel funny, tell us right away. I will. Can't wait to leave this rock. All right, the harbor, come. Hey, my lady. What is it now? You're the Countess's guests, aren't you? Are you hurt? No. We have orders to escort you safely to the palace. Actually, we were about to leave. You have guests. Guests? Who? Your mother and a boy. <sighs> oh, of course. Do you think she's going to scold us? I don't know. I... We should go see her. It's been a long time. Yes. We can't run away from this, I guess. Wow. Look at the two of you. Only a mum can have such power over someone. All right. You know what? I'll head to the harbor and prepare the boat. You join me as soon as you can. Take this. Whatever happens, keep this flame alive, all right? Yes. Be careful. Don't worry. I've learned from both of you. Lead the way, then. What will we tell her? The truth. We found what we came for. And I'm the one to blame. I'll defend you. My hero. Hurry! Move before they come back! Is the palace going to hold, sir? For now. The Count opened the again. gates to the people. But there's so many dead and Get wounded. We've seen that. Stay back! It's like the one we saw! The broken one! Shh! Yes. Where did they get it? You're safe as long as you stay inside this line. But outside, without light... Yes. We know. Anyway, you're safe now. Are you not planning to evacuate? Not yet. Not until we've got everybody regrouped. Hold the line! We need more fires on the main road! Pick up the pace! Keep these flames fed! It looks like a wall! Give me a hand with it. The rats are pushing on our east flank! We need torches there! They should evacuate! Yes! No one can win against them! Stays here, lady. We'll need it to carry the wounded. Uh, my belongings? You can, carry, you can bring them inside. All right, I understand. Good luck. Dig trenches along the ramparts and fill them with tar. Keep them burning. Any breach could make the palace fall. And if the rats enter the palace, then you're dead. Keep them burning. Have you fixed the piston yet? We need this cart on the ramparts fast. Another one. Get off my back. This thing's so old, it might just explode. We've got wounded up here. It's not pretty. The uh, child may want to look away. I know blood. Still, try not to look. <gasps> there are more. My arm! It's burning! That one's have been bitten. Yes, it will soon spread. No, he's not dead. He can't be. It's over. Let him go. No, no. Come to your senses. We've got the more wounded coming. So it means the child is coming. The child is supposed to lead us to brighter days, not this carnage. Quiet! This is not the time to argue! Children! Blessed be the camp for this food! 
It's not much, but we have to mind our supplies. Let's pray this nightmare ends soon. This is my fault. Shh, please. <laughs> this is but a test the child senses. You must not lose faith. Are the rats really announcing his coming? Through there. Why is he killing us? Still you too. your hearts. Pray to him. Just pray. Mummy! You're here. My God, you're alive. Mother, come here. Please, come here. Mother! How are you? Your head. It's fine, don't worry. How did you find us? You left quite a trail behind you. But tell me, is it the one? This island? The one from your dream? There was another carrier, like me. Another carrier? Yes. Back in the 6th century. A child called Basilius. We found him chained in an order prison designed especially for him. What? I think they panicked when he reached his last threshold. They took him away from his protector. Locked him in there to contain what would happen next. A new plague? In the 6th century, that's... The Justinian Plague. We knew it was connected to the Macula, but... So it started here, with this Basilius. But it was not his fault. He was just all alone and scared. Yes. Mother, Magister Vaudan said Hugo is condemned. But this is what the Order believes, based on their mistake in the past with Basilius. If he'd had his protector, like Hugo has us, I'm almost sure nothing would have happened. Think about it. During the last months on the road, the times when it was quiet, everything was just fine. He was fine. That's true. Something tells me that if we settle down somewhere safe and live there as a family... Maybe the plague would stop with time. It, it would stop getting worse. Fear really clouded our minds, didn't it? Except yours, Protector. Yes. Remember that house we have in the mountains? We'll be great there. We'll be big and tall. Sorry to interrupt. The Count wants to see you. Me? Now? But we were about to leave. He is the Count of Provence, my lady. Yes. We'll wait for you. For now, we're safer here than outside anyway. Fine. Take me to him. Follow me. Do you know what the Count wants with me? No. I, I thought he would be attending to more urgent matters. Seeing you must be an urgent matter. Act with dignity in his presence. These are dark times. He's touched, like any of us. All right. I will. The main gate is secure enough for now, but the western rampart is still weak. If the rats enter through there, we won't be able to evacuate the wounded. Now, I want to know where those Wait rats here. come from. Send scouts. If we can find a way to slow them, stop them, or send them to hell, it'll be worth the risk. Sire, she's here. Good. This is a war unlike any other. But it is still a war. Dismissed. And have faith. It's not over yet. Yes, yes, sir. yes sir! Come. I need you. Very well. Count. So you survived those beasts? Barely. I'm sorry for your land. A lord should know that no peace lasts forever. But I confess that after years of war, I had dared to hope that this one would. I understand. The scars are still so vivid. They fill the mind when you want only rest. Uh, sorry, I... No. No. That's exactly it. It's only human. I think. You're right. 
But it doesn't stop you from being there when battle calls. Yes. I beg you, brothers and sisters, do not be afraid. The rats are the heralds of the child of Embers. He will return to us soon. Is the child really coming? All the signs are here. You mean the rats? Not only the rats. Come. You'll see for yourself. Yes. I'm sorry, but she is sure now. Sure about what? That your brother is the child of Embers. She must have him, so you must die. No, no, listen! You are all completely wrong about this! Your cult, everything! You're probably right. Because I invented most of it. And I did it for her. What? Emily. Her bloody parents broke her mind until she tried to take her own life. Poisoned her own body. So I brought her here, offered her this Child of Ember's story, and not only did she believe it, she turned it into hope for the people. You fed her alive! What are you trying to do? Accept your fate! Yeah! Oh, damn you! You go... Run! How dare you! Come back! Get back to them! Go! I won't lose her. Not for you. Go to hell. Where are you going? You won't have him! Move to the right. Come on. Quick. You can't imagine what's at stake. Go to hell, you bastard! No. I tried to be patient. No. no. You won't get him! No. I'll find you. And you will die like a dog. Hey, what's going on? I need help. Please, how do I get out of here? Who are you? <laughs> Where is she? Uh, behind that door. <gasps> Shut up. Everybody out. Keep out of sight. You and me. Now. Please move. Uh, behind that door. <gasps> Shut up. Everybody out. Keep out of sight. You and me. <gasps> Come on. Let's finish this. I know it seems unfair, but you don't know what it takes to rule. Oh, it's so easy. I could destroy everything. But she showed me another way. She has a light about her. You see? There you are. Hey! What's going on? Stay back! No! You're trespassing! Lucas, how I always touched them! It's too late. Now she knows he exists. Bastard! Bastard! <laughs> People believe in her as much as in the child. Stay away from me! Don't you get it? This is bigger than you! Give up! Surrender your brother! We can't do this the easy way! Sloppy. 
Close him quick! That cover won't save you from me. Do you really think hiding behind that will save you? You're stuck here. Wherever you go, I'll find you. I've been trained for this. Amicia, come to me. It hurts terribly, doesn't it? But I can ease the pain. Trust me. Hiding is pointless. You have no... I know where you are. Your survival instinct. I admire it. You've been through a lot, I can tell. It makes this even more exciting. Since I hunted, since I met Emily, that you are the one that will pray. I'll get you as soon as I can. They'll take him away. Mother, Lucas, get them out of here. Even if it hurts. Afraid. Yes, you failed, but this child was never truly yours. I feel so full of him. Hugo won't heal the wounds of your past. He will fill no void in you. You'll die. Everybody will. No! He will be loved. He will shine like a brighter sun. Repel this darkness, and I... I'll just be a mother, watching the first steps of a god. Shut up! You have no claim to this family! Amicia! How are you still alive? Where's Hugo? Inside, go! Run! <laughs> <laughs> 
down. At last. Sorry, my love, but this one's a hell of a fighter. Now this. This is an invitation I can't refuse. You caught me by surprise, I'm impressed. You're quite something, you know. You face me, thinking with all your soul that you can defeat me. I can. You won't have my brother. <laughs> Such dedication. <laughs> <laughs> Of a burning fire inside you. But a flame without discipline doesn't make a soldier. It consumes them from within. I'm not a soldier! Oh, I know. You fight because you don't have the choice. I chose this life. This is why you'll fail. You talk a lot, coward! Steady your stance! Stand your ground! Grip that sword properly. You're a disgrace to it. You never fight to defend yourself. Fight to kill, to conquer! Whatever. You're still a coward! Who do you think you are to defy me? I'm Amicia! Jeroen! Ah, shut up! I'm dying to for no one! Shut up! Amicia! You see, you kneel just fine. No. From one mother to another. Enough games, Victor. This is not what we're here for. <sighs> I'm sorry. War took its toll on my husband. He gets carried away sometimes. I admire you. Your children are strong. Your bonds are strong. When I was her age, I could only wish for this kind of love. But it's not just about us. For love is meant to be shared, to be turned into light, shone over the whole world. Such is the fate of the Child of Embers. Love can kill Emily. By the time you realize that, it will be too late. For now, it will be quick. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Amicia? Mummy? I feel funny.
real. Oh, there's people. Emily? Oh, my baby boy! You should oh. get back to bed! Hugo... You killed her! No, no! I I'll take you back to bed! Victor, take him back, will you? Amicia? Amicia, where are you? I'm... I'm here! Uh... Oh... Oh no! Hugo! 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 No! Answer me! Say something! Hugo! No! <laughs> oh, thank you! Thank you! We're all right! You're all right! We're all right! <laughs>
Please, you go. Say something. Look at me, please. I need you. Amicia, we can't stay here. He won't talk to me. We need to leave. Hugo, answer me. Amicia, we need to leave. To go where? The harbor. We're leaving this place. I want rest. You can rest when you're safe. We will never be, Lucas. Never. There can be no peace for us. Look at him. <laughs> I'll lead the way. Don't think. Just follow me. I'll be your path for the both of you. I'll carry you if I must. But I'm taking you out of here. Take a deep breath and stand up. You did it. Come on, Hugo. Good. I'm taking you out of here. 